dead. I know who you are. I got another good Watch one out. for you. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug. You got it, boss. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. You'll have to ask Lily. She's the one handling the rations. Or mishandling it, if you ask Kenny. He's just worried about his kid getting enough. I worry about Clementine, too. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor end. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Maybe he'll be better off without us. We'll have three fewer mouths to feed. And one fewer gun hand. One way or the other, it's a bad situation. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. He thinks I'm a danger to the group, and Clementine. I think he's the one putting us in danger. The way Lily worries about his health? I wouldn't be surprised if she's been skimming rations for him. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. It's a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. Ah! Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! Ah! <laughs> 
Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Please, this is fucked up. We've gotta help you. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. I gotta get him out of there. Oh, God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. Hurry, please, hurry! Lee, this trap's been altered. There's no release latch. Oh no. Shit! Walkers! It's now or never, Lee! Please! Get me out of this! Mark, get the boys back! Kenny, keep those walkers off of me! Damn, this is bad. Really bad. Why is this Just happening to us? Please! All that blood is We're gonna something. be surrounded any minute! Please! This can't be Get me out! Oh god! Try to get the chain! To cut you out! No, no, no! Try the trap again! Anything, please! Let's go! Let's go! Lee, <laughs> it has to be now! <laughs> We have to go, now! Ah! Oh God. Oh, shit. Is he? He passed out. If he's alive, grab him and let's go! Ah! Oh. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on, we gotta move! It's open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! Oh my god! What happened? Oh, what What's going on? We don't have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken! Lee! I, I don't know! Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here! What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? What's no, your mouth? I don't! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. We left the other one behind. Other one? Jesus, Lee. What if there are more of them? What if they followed you here? There wasn't anybody else. Just us. How do you know he's not lying? Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. 
Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? You think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food, but nobody else wants to. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Your hat. I don't know. Can you help me find it? Do you really need it? My dad gave it to me for my birthday. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Claire. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. If you have any more food, Duck is hungry too. Yeah, why don't we then get some food? Hey, Duck. How about a little food? Here! Yeah! Oh man, I'm so hungry! Want something to eat? Have an apple, Carly. God, I used to eat an apple every morning with some granola and six almonds, and that wasn't enough even then. But you know what? Yes. I need to keep my strength up, too. Not such an easy job, is it? I don't envy you. I don't... 